up YouTube? We're back again with another vlog or another video. Once again, we're in the garage working on the stealth. Um, oh, hold on. I just noticed something. Give me one second. There. Now you guys might be able to see a little bit better. So, um, yeah, we're back in the garage today. We're going to be working on the stealth. Once again, it's got a tarp over it because, um, well, we're kind of painting right there, so... I kind of don't want to get paint, even though that's kind of exposed, but that's the finished product of the one side of one of the tires. Uh, let me know what you guys think of that. Brake caliber has been painted, and um, tire letters are done on that too. So let me know what you guys think of that. But today it's just going to be kind of like a hangout, do whatever, find something to do. So uh, let's get to it. We're gonna try this, see if this works a little bit better. Again, for those of you who are new to the channel, this is my 1993 Dodge Stealth Twin Turbo. Basically, if you guys know anything about the Dodge Stealths and the 3000 GTs, they were basically the same vehicle. Um, back in like the 90s, Mitsubishi did um, a thing with uh, Chrysler. So um, basically, this is a DSM, as they would call it. But uh, don't mind that orange tape. I need to get a new connector for that. Um, it's actually cracked there, so I gotta get a new connector. But uh, yeah, it's slowly coming together. We're slowly piecing everything together, making it look nice. Um, I do have a blow off valve coming, and it's down there. That is coming soon. Um, again, turbo's down there and everything. There's a turbo in the back, so. But we're gonna be working on her today, and making her look nice so let's get to it again so I have decided to kind of like wait on cleaning the engine bay because I want to actually end up taking that off and polishing it um, this bracket would have to come off there's a lot of things that I'm gonna want to take off to clean them but uh, with this uh, I think it's intercooler yeah intercooling intercooler piping all that um is going to get replaced this y pipe is going to get replaced with an actual intercooler but if any of you who actually have 3000 gts or dodge stealths um they have an intercooler setup uh let me know what kind of intercooler setup you have uh just kind of looking for a different intercooler in that because it's still got the stock two ones on the each side of the headlight or underneath the headlight as it's called but um yeah, we're going to end up actually re relocating the battery to the back. Um, kind of freeing up space, make it look a lot cleaner. Um, I'm going to need to get a new battery anyways. But, yeah, this is definitely going to be a project, guys. And it's going to look really, really nice after we're all finished with it. I'm glad I'm going to be able to take you guys on this trip with me to bring in this car back to life, back to what it was. And... I really hope you guys are going to enjoy this, but right now, let's get to back to the painting, what I was doing earlier, so let's get back to that. Taking this mount off, because I'm going to end up painting this because it looks bad. So, I'm just slowly taking small stuff off and painting it, so it looks nice, so uh, that's what I've been doing, guys. But, you guys don't really want to see that. So, again, trying to make the best videos as I can. It's just been 
real hard for me to make a lot of good videos, guys, because there's not much here in Michigan that I can film. But I'm attempting to make a lot better videos. I still got to get a review of the Blue Stealth, and I'm going to do a review of this one. They're going to be kind of different because they're both different. Well, technically, they're same car, but they're technically different. If you know what I mean. So I got to get a reviews of those. If you want, I will do a review on the Jimmy too. So, um, but we are going to attempt to do a lot more videos in the future, guys. It's just been real slow lately. So, again, I'm sorry that I haven't posted much. And there's a bolt there missing. Cool. That's nice. But... Yeah, we're going to do a lot more. I will do the install of the blow-off valve. I will show you that. Um, but this car is going to be sometime between now and two weeks from later. This car is going to be going up to Grand Rapids, Michigan to a guy named Matt Weber. He's going to be doing my 60K. A really good guy. I suggest if you guys got a 3000 DT and you guys are in the Michigan area, take the hem. Um, he's actually been a family friend for a long time, so my mom personally knows him, and my um, aunt knows him. So again, I'm really excited to see what this car can do. I haven't driven it that much because of the worrying about the uh, timing belt snapping and that. But as soon as I get the 60k done, I'm gonna drive a lot in this car. So, but. Again, guys, I'm sorry that this wasn't a much, like a video where we can do a lot and all that. This is just kind of me talking to you guys, and I said I know I said I would do this and that, and again, I'm sorry, but this is just a video right now to just express what what's going to what's going to happen with the channel, with the cars, uh, future plans, and that. So, again. This is going to be the end of the video, guys. Sorry that I couldn't do much, but it's kind of hard to do much when you're kind of limited on money. So, kind of need money to do a lot of things. But, again, guys, more videos will be coming. Um, I do suggest, if you haven't already, go subscribe to Agent Black 5.0, one of my best friends in the world. He's a really good guy. I... I miss you, Michael. I mean, I wish we could do videos right now, but you're over in Florida doing cars and coffee videos, doing all sorts of cool videos. So, again, hopefully I can start doing videos like you, man. But, again, guys, go subscribe to him. Great guy. Makes amazing videos. Hopefully, me and him will be at Grid Life. Um, I think it's June. Yeah, I think it's June is when Grid Life is. So, I'll probably be there. Uh, Asia Black's going to be there. So, again, guys, thank you for watching this video. This is Redhead Gearhead, signing off.